Hi there and welcome back to Champions of Kryn. I am Baron and we are in the second outpost. And I did some I fought some battle against giants on the overland map. <coughs> that had the nice effect that Rekaldori now has twenty seven thousand um three hundred twenty two experience points. That should be enough to actually change her class. Rekaldorian is petitioning to become a Knight of the Rose. Rekaldorian may become a Knight of the Rose. You have to have 27,000 experience points to do that. And we actually do that. And now Rekaldorian is a Knight of the Rose. Awesome. Maybe I should have named her set via Rose. Nah, I think Rekaldorian is fine. And as a side effect of that, due to the experience uh, that we got, Sylvia Saint now is a level 5 Magia Cleric. She has 60 hit points now, as you can clearly see. But she's the only one that actually got a level out of that. Fine. And I I googled the thing with the platinum. As it turns out, platinum is is, an, is another current currency. But you cannot deposit platinum in the vault. But you can use it as a you know a means of payment. If you don't have steel, you can pay with platinum to its worth less than steel I guess so what I did I took the platinum and bought a few gems diamonds and I sold them and that way I transferred transformed the platinum into steel and then I deposited the steel into the, the bank into the bank vault so now we have like Ten thousand six hundred steel pieces in the vault. I have no idea whether that is much or not. We shall see. So we have heard that, that there's rumors. There are rumors that there's a dragon lance in Gargath. So how about we try to get that? You stand within the gates of Gargath. The guards demand to know your business. Uh, we could say we're tradesmen, we could leave or we could attack. Since we're not really tradesmen, we we'll probably have to fight him anyway. We attack. A battle big. Ui. Ui, ui, ui. That's. That's a lot. Hmm, okay. What could you do? Um, old person? Would that work? Yeah, I tried. You also should try to cast a spell. You cast a stinking cloud. You could try that here. It doesn't work on that. It's too far away, actually. Dang it. Then try it here. Okay, the ogre starts to cough. You try to hold those because they are elvish rogues. They can they're they actually multi multi-class fighter mages, they can cast spells. Not funny. Held. Unaffected. Held. You cast a magic missile on him. And you attack him. Ouch. You know, you're helpless. Yeah, what are you doing, ogre? Wait. Did you just move in here? Ow. Fuck. He attacked Sarah Whites. Uh, we cast another one, hold person.
on you again on you and on you okay that works nicely he has 18 hit points um okay Oh, you can't cast. I get it. And you can't use your thingy because... Ah, shit. You ca she can't use the darts because that ogre is too close. Um, if she get, tries to move away, the ogre will attack. Oh, that's not nice. So we change your weapons. Get out the quarter staff. Hey, oh the hands are full. Six damage. That's not too bad. Missed. So, you have been hurt too. You can't cast. Yeah, ready, sorry. Oh yeah, I have to unready that of course. How could I forget that? So, you happen to be helpless. Oh, come on. You happen to be dead. The mages are safe, I hope. So, you cast another stinking cloud. You annoy the fuck out of me. Fine, forget it then. Yes, lose it. So... Oh yeah, of course, we have to switch your weapons back. I mean, this annoys the fuck out of me that you can't use the spell. Hmm. Maybe if you move one step... Nah, forget it. You have wasted it, that spell anyway, so it doesn't matter. Awesome. Yo. Great. You're not hitting anything. What do you have spell wise? Stinking cloud, magic missile, sleep. Would a sleep work on those guys? Probably not, right? What the fuck was that all about? Didn't I say aim? Apparently not. Ha, of course. My mistake, you have to get the darts back out. Ooh, two damage, four damage, yay. 11 damage. You 
that. Fourteen, nice. That's working nicely. How many hit points do you have? Still 15. Ah, he's a, the ogre surrenders. Nobody has been hitting the ogre, the fighter surrenders too. Fine, we will not continue. The party has won. Each character receives 459 hit points. No, experience points. Hit points would be nice too. But we don't get that many hit points. Two-handed swords, bandit mail, is anything magical? No. So you have plate. You have chain plus one. Would the bandit mail be better? It's probably not as good as plate, right? Oh, 200 swords. That's nice. You take one. You take one. Did you take it? No, you didn't. So, plate mail gives you an armor class of minus two. If you switch to banded mail, you have minus one. So it's not as good as I thought. Um, then drop it. Like it's hard. So you have a 1d8 plus 5. 1d10 plus 5. Hmm. But your armor class, you lose the effect of the shield. Oh well. So we should probably trade the ring to Randy Spears. One D ten plus three. So you give that shield to Sylvia Saint Dun. Um, she has an armor class of minus one. Minus one. Hmm. But now she could use a ring of protection because the plate isn't magical. Uh, the banded mat isn't magical, so I guess it's better. It's heavier though, but hey. And um, items, you don't need that shield when you have this one. Minus two. Okay, what else do we get? Nothing that we really need. So we leave. There's still treasure left. Do you want it? No, I don't want it. Guards drop rocks and other missiles from holes in the ceiling. You're not supposed to do that. 
This is rude. Where are we? Interesting. Let's head north. The guards above yell out an alarm. No shit. A townsman comes up to you. He mentions Sir Carl and you rec record it as journal entry 48. So... Um, 48. Yeah, I went to see the... No, it's a tavern tail. Du, du, du. 48. Well, that's a short one. Finally, you're here. I got word that Sir Carl was going to send someone to check this place out. I've been waiting for for you for days. Come with me. Follow him? Yes. The man explains himself. You record it. Is it record or record? It's probably record, right? You record it as journal entry 27. Um, 27, 27. No, it's actually 26. Get your numbers straight. Gorgos was overrun about a week ago. There were only a few of us here at that time, trying to rebuild after the War of the Lands. Draconians and evil forces snuck in at night and captured the keep. Since then they have been bringing in prisoners and putting them to work. They make us wear these hoods to keep track of us. Ah, we're moving around. Slowly. But steadily. Put these on. He hands you hoods similar to the one that he is wearing. Do you put them on? Sure. He's probably trying to help. The man speaks of the keep. Your record is it as journal entry 43. They have built up a large wooden structure in front of the main gates of the keep. I don't know what it looks like inside. I can tell you that the main gates are in the upper northwest corner of the city. In the middle of the city you will find a secret door into the wooden structure. It is currently being guarded by Draconians because its location has been discovered, discovered recently. He licks his lips in consternation and suddenly speaks in hushed intensity. Listen. There's a dragon lance in the keep. I know all of them were supposed to be sent south during Huh? All of them were supposed to be sent south, but the Castellan was injured during the war, and his lance was brought with him when he returned. You must find it. You don't happen to know where it is exactly. You can get more information in the tavern to the west, just beyond the inn. You must find a dragon lance. No shit. He bows and leaves. Take a bow. So, well, 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 where are we now? Um, take a look at the area. Oh, here. Um, could we probably camp and rest? First we should save. And fix. Better. And I think you used a few spells, is that correct? Um, can I get a fireball as a bonus spell? Yes, I can. Awesome. Uh, then rest. I like that. So, how about we save again after we rested so nicely? So um, we are here. Where do we want to go from here?
So that leads to the north. Monsters attack. What the fuck? Okay. I, I'm still in a building. What do we have here? An elvish curate. Okay. Great. Um, well. Cast a magic missile. To keep him from casting. You delay. You try to turn the undead. You move on. Shit! You were supposed to hit the curate. Oh well. <laughs> he actually comes down, that's stupid. Recordorian? Oh, come on. Try again. He has one lousy hit point. Seems to be enough to keep him alive, apparently. Good riddance. I'm sweeping here. No? Okay, apparently you have to be a warrior class to sweep. But even Rackle misses. Fine, you got. You don't do anything. Are they trying to get away? Um, maybe we should switch to ranged weapon now. Fuck you. Where are you going? Oh, is anybody here? Oh, you know what? Done. God. Rats flee in panic. Let them. It is not virtuous to um, pursue a f fleeing animal, an opponent that is not evil. We all know that from Ultima 4, right? This cave is blocked, that sucks to be you. Red got away. 91 experience points. Oh well. What did we get? Nothing. No. How about we <laughs> encamp again? Fix. Who casted a magic missile? Not you, apparently. 
And yeah, but you apparently, yeah, the bonus spell is, um, yeah, forget it. Fine. I don't know how many random encounters we will meet here. Let's take a look at a map. We are... Here, apparently. Interesting. Uh, no. Area. Move. This room is filled with soldiers sharpening weapons, polishing armor and practicing. One of them demands, what in the abyss do you think you're doing here? Yeah, what are we doing here? Well, we're merely exploring. But um, that should not be too much of a problem, right? Oh well, maybe it is. We attack. Better fight them now than later. Oh shit. You wh wh what? Elvish killers. Elvish killers, evil fighters, thaumaturgists. They look like spellcasters. Interesting. So, well, well, well. Maybe. Who are you? Okay, Genevieve Jolie, our red mage. Could cast a fireball. Um, what could you do? You delay for a bit. You should yell. So, indoors, the manual says it goes three spaces. One. If I target it here, it goes one, one, two, three. So, one, two, three. I don't really know whether it would still get her. One, two, three. If it would be a radius, I think it would be like this. Those three, then those three. Ah, we shall see. So let's target it here. Ha! Nicely! Silver Saint was not hit at all. So. Um, well, Reckle, you have your nice two-handed sword. How about you use it? You could cast a whole person. You could also attack. Okay. So, I would want... You take an art. And um, maybe you. And you. You. Wait. You. Help. Unaffected. Unaffected. Boo. So, what could we do now? You have 7 hit points. A magic missile could be your end. It is your end. How? How? You again cast a whole person. 
because you feel like it, who is held. Okay, um, how about you target it on him? Him and him. Held. Yeah, seems to work better on the humans. Oh, unaffected. So, how about you cast. Wait, let's take a look. Hmm. I was thinking, Cloud, if you can aim it in here. I hate you. Can you aim it in here? Yes. So. You happen to be helpless. So if you could cast it here, would you be able to cast it here? That's one, two, three. One, two, three, yeah, probably not. Probably not. What could you cast? Asleep. Yeah, that probably wouldn't work on the elves. Maybe it would work on him. Well, he's helpless too. Yeah, well, okay. Maybe you can put one to sleep. Then you use it. Here. Ah, that didn't work. Too bad. Who is helpless? Nobody. Come on. Thanks. Hmm. Sucks to be you. I don't want to go in there. Fine. How could you miss her? You don't have a magic missile. You know what? Fireball. One, two, three. Yay! Genevieve Julie comes through. You're done. What? 
Did she flee? Oh, they surrender. Okay. One more kill. And evil fighter surrenders too. So, 454 experience points. That's not too shabby. What do we get? Is there anything magical here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. No, I don't want it. Okay, so how about we call it the video then and continue in the next one? So, thank you very much for watching. And see you soon. Bye.